It's time for today's travel and cruise industry news. With the latest from travel and cruises around the world, here's your host, Chili Falls. Carnival Cruise Line has finally announced fleet changes to four ships not returning to service and the ships that will be replacing them on the schedule. As always, we appreciate a thumbs up for the videos, and this is an excerpt to Travel and Cruise Industry News from July 23rd. Um, and according to our friend Ben Sousa over at Cruise uh, Fever, a Carnival Cruise Line has given an update on the uh, fleet of cruise ships today that includes the cruise line selling two fantasy class ships and two other vessels going to long-term layup status. I'm not sure what that means, but that's what the uh, Carnival has said it. And remember, folks, a lot of the information that we've shared on what's happening with these cruise ships has been on speculation and insider information that we've picked up here and there. It's not officially come from Carnival or has their schedules uh, changed uh, on any of these ships. However, as part of Carnival Corporation's recent announcement to sell 13 older cruise ships, and focus on ships with upgraded features, Carnival Fantasy and Carnival Inspiration have been sold. That we knew, and we reported that earlier. Carnival Fascination and Carnival Imagination will move to a long-term layup status, and neither ship has a timeline to return to service. Carnival Sensation will move from Miami to Mobile and take up itineraries previously assigned to Carnival Fantasy and Carnival Fascination. Guests who are booked on those two ships are being re-accommodated on Carnival Sensation. Carnival Sunrise, the ship that I was on in February, will move from Port Everglades to Port Miami and assume the itineraries previously operated by Carnival Sensation providing a larger upgraded ship for short itineraries with many of the new features installed during Carnival Sunrise $200 million transformation completed in 2019. Guests booked on the Sunrise four and five day itineraries from Port Everglades will be automatically moved to sailings from Port Miami. Carnival Sunrise is part of Carnival's 50th uh, birthday celebration, and there will be no changes to her birthday sailing, which is scheduled for March 5th, 2022. These special sailings have been in high demand and will feature special entertainment, at sea ship rendezvous, and onboard activities and offerings. Carnival Fascination itineraries from San Juan and Barbados have been canceled for 2020 and 21, as a cruise line focuses its return to operations on mainland drive markets in the U.S. Itineraries for Carnival Imagination and Carnival Inspiration from Long Beach have been canceled through April 19, 2021. Carnival Panorama will continue to operate seven-day cruises from Long Beach, while Carnival Miracle will operate shorter itineraries from San Diego to Baja, Mexico. Carnival Radiance will now move directly from Europe after its $200 million transformation and home port in Long Beach in April of 2021, where it will assume the short Baja, Mexico itineraries previously served by Carnival Imagination and Carnival Inspiration. So, that is a Carnival actually physically announcing what's going to happen with all their ships. And of course, uh, as changes are made to this, we will uh, bring you more updated news as soon as we get it. So glad to find out what's going on with uh, Carnival. If you'd like to keep up with the latest in travel and cruise industry news, Hit the little subscribe button in the lower right-hand corner. Hit the bell notification button and see when we go live or when a new video is posted.
Thank you for watching today's travel and cruise industry news. Join us every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday morning at 11 a.m. Eastern for another episode. Travel and Cruise Industry News is a production of Chili's Cruises.